Hello kids and thank you for joining me today. I am here at a factory to learn about the vocabulary used with multiplication. To start out, let's take a closer look at these two factories. Here we have two factories, and in factories we make products. For example, here comes parts, and when they come out the factories, they are a finished product that we can use. Knowing about factories and products will help us learn about multiplication. Let's bring in a multiplication problem and take a look. Here we have 3 multiplied by 5 equals 15. Each of these numbers has a special name that we use in multiplication. The 3 and the 5 are called factors. The number 15 is the answer. The answer in a multiplication problem is called the product. Just like the example, we have a factory and it produces a product. <laughs> these factors go to work and make a product. The product in a multiplication problem is always going to be bigger than the factors. This makes sense because just like a factory, you take small parts to make one big product. Now that we have learned some of the vocabulary, let's review with another problem. Here is the equation 4 multiplied by 3 equals 12. Can you tell me what numbers are the factors? The 4 and the 3 are the factors. Great job! What number is the product? The number 12 is the product of the factors 4 and 3. You guys are amazing! Stay tuned next time for more videos and math games. Goodbye! Okay guys, you have a few options here. You can click the video on my right or on my left to watch more awesome stuff. If you want to subscribe, click the big red subscribe button below. You might want to hurry and choose though, because I can't hold on forever. Hurry, choose.